around on my exercise ball. I don't know if you know that, but that's what I sit on. I don't sit on a chair. I sit on one of those giant exercise balls. And I'm just waiting for my notification. And there it is. So a few minutes ago, I had actually hit live and I was chatting away and I'm like, where's my notification? How come it's not coming on? So I scooted around the back of my camera because I can't see um, on the front of my camera the way I've got it set up. And I'm like, I hadn't even turned it on. So anyway, I'm glad you're here. Bonjour, Lucy. Bonjour, Christine. And uh, bonjour, Jean. Let me introduce myself. Hello, bonjour. My name is Denise Willerton and I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator in Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada. I am thrilled that you're here with me. And Jean, I see that you've shared. So the girls that are regulars, they, um, they know my drill. If they share, they're entered in a draw for a prize. And I kind of remind people as I, as I go along here with my live. Um, and so if you do not have a Stampin' Up! demonstrator, I would be honored to be that for you. Um, if you do have a Stampin' Up! demonstrator, that is great. Please stay. I hope that you leave with some inspiration. I am super excited about this card. Karen, I haven't seen you in so long. Hello. And you know what? I have your paper pumpkin box here for you. So I will get that to you. I promise. Um, uh, let me turn the volume off. Hi, Barb. Welcome here. I'm going to turn the volume off on my iPad. Pardon me while I, while I creep in there. Um, okay. So I need my pen. Jean, you shared. I'm going to bring the camera down. Hello, Sherry. Welcome here. Nice to see your name. And Kathy, you too. Welcome here. I'm going to bring the camera down, girls, and uh, I'm super excited about today's card. Actually, before I bring the camera down, who is, um, so Jean shared, I'm going to write Jean's name down, and I'm going to write down Sherry's name, because she shared, and Karen, she shared. Um, let's see who else shared. Um, Lucy shared. Hello, Barb, you shared. Okay, so Lucy and Barb shared and Kathy shared. Thank you so much for sharing, girls. Your name is all going to be entered in my draw at the end of, uh, of my live because when you share, you get entered into a draw. So who has, um, who has cut their DSP and who has cut their cardstock as per my instructions yesterday? I want to know who is playing along with me today. And last week, um, Barb played along. And Barb, I forgot that you played along. And okay, Barb, you are. Yay, I'm so glad. I totally forgot last week that you were playing along, Barb. So I'm glad you're playing. Jean is playing along. Hi, Shelly. Welcome here. I miss you. We have to get together via our messenger chatting thing. Uh, Kathy, you're playing along. Um, Sherry's playing along. That is awesome. I'm so excited. Do you know what we're doing today? Did anybody, did, did my cutting instructions kind of give anybody a clue? I'm going to bring the camera down, okay? So hang on if this makes you dizzy. And let's just swing that around. Okay, I am so excited for those that are playing along today. Um, let me see. I want to make sure that we are situated. So, so far, I'm going to call your names out um, and let me know if I missed you so that I can enter you for my prize draw. So, Jean shared, Karen did, uh, Sherry did, Lucy, Barb, and Kathy. Did I forget anyone? I, Shelly, we have to talk. I want to hear all about your new job. And Chris is playing along. Um, you know what, girls? Uh, 
I never knew that brain fog was a real thing after the treatments that I had a couple of years ago, but I'm starting to believe that it really is. You know what, Dar? I did not see your cards, but I did write you down for sharing. Um, and Dar, you just shared too. Uh, okay, so Darlene is playing. Kathy is playing. Chris. Barb. Um... Oh, Kathy, sorry, my cancer treatments. And they told me that, um, they told me that after radiation, uh, you would probably suffer brain fog. And I'm thinking, yeah, right, give me a break. Not me, that's not going to happen. And uh, anyway, it's a thing and it's true. So, so far for playing along, I have Dar, Kathy, Chris, Barb, Cherie, or Sherry, sorry, you said you were playing along. Am I missing anyone? I just want to kind of keep in touch with the girls that are playing along. Here is what we are doing. And this I saw on uh, Rachel Tessman. And there are, there are tons of other demonstrators that are doing this. This is called the Pinwheel Tower card, okay? Kind of like the never-ending card. So it sits like so, and that's what all that, uh, that funky cutting was all about, okay? So for this card, I used the, um, what is it called? I love this paper. Beautiful Autumn, I think, or Beauty of the Earth. I wasn't even close. <laughs> it wasn't even close, not even a little bit. So Beauty of the Earth, that's what I used for this, okay? I did a little bit of stamping. I did some cutting, okay? So who is ready for this? And there's your pinwheel tower card. It is so fun, girls. It is so fun. I'm excited for those that are playing along. Karen, did you say that you were playing along too? I can't remember now. Let's see if I can see that. Um, I'm just going back here. And maybe you didn't. Karen is saying hello and that she shared. But, okay, if anybody else is playing along, please let me know. Okay? And if anybody else shares, let me know. Um, so here we go. Now, the... Um, no, but you, okay, you love watching? Well, take notes, my, well, actually, you don't really need to take a whole lot of notes, Karen, because um, the, the post that I did gave you all the dimensions. So the, let me see here. The first thing I want you to do, girls, is I want you to grab your four and a quarter by four and a quarter square piece of DSP, okay? Oh, yay, Jay, you got the apartment. That's awesome. When does he move, Dar? So grab your scoreboard and grab your DSP and that measures four and a quarter by four and a quarter, okay? We are going to score at, make sure you're using your score blade and not your cut blade, okay? You're scoring at one inch. Hi, Jenna. Welcome here, hon. You're scoring at two inches. Jenna, are you playing along? Did you, um, did you do the cutting that I sent out yesterday? You're scoring at three inches. And then you're scoring at four. So your four and a quarter by four and a quarter piece of DSP is scored every inch which leaves you with a little quarter inch tab, okay? So let's get that folded up. So, and it doesn't really matter which way you fold, you're, mo you're, you're going to be seeing the inside, okay? Because it's the tower card. So whatever, whichever way you fold, you're, for me, I would either be seeing this on the inside or this. You're making salsa. Hun, I have not started mine yet. And let's give that a score. So you're scoring one inch. And give those a nice little burnish. 
and then one more and last but not least now when you're burnishing see how I've got my quarter inch here when you're burnishing a small area like that it's best to put the small area down under and burnish on top okay if you burnish this way it's very easy because this is so um, so slim it's easy to um, it's easy to accidentally lose your, your score line. That's what I do anyway. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put a little bit of adhesive on that strip. And you wanna make sure that you're not getting it inside. And you know what, I'm gonna use my Tombow. Oh, is Candace here? I must have missed saying hi to her. So I'm just putting a very thin, come on baby, a very thin strip down. And then all you're going to do, remember we scored at one, two, three, and then four. You're going to fold at the halfway mark and just bring it up to that. Okay? And there you go. There is our tower that is created for the beginning of our card. Okay? Everybody there? You took the week off to can. Because you're homeschooling, aren't you, Jenna? It seems to me you're a homeschooler. So is my daughter. Sandy, welcome here, my friend. Nice to see your name pop up, dear. My daughter is also a homeschooler. Okay. Let's grab our two and three quarter inch by four and a quarter inch, and we've got four pieces, okay? Is everybody with me? I don't wanna jump ahead if you are lagging behind, but it is pretty simple. Let's get that adhesive off of there, okay? You can use your tape runner if you want, and I'm going to, I'm, I'm so used to using my Tombow. I don't know if I'm going to enjoy doing this with Tape Runner, but let's see. Carol, welcome here, my friend. You know what we are working on? We are working on the tower card, okay? And I used this one. I used Beauty of the Earth, and this one I'm using the Penguin Paper, which incidentally is free if you place a $60 order um, you can place that in my online store or you can give me your order and I can submit that for you. Carol, I've got you down. Thank you for sharing, my friend. Well, we are safe and healthy here, Sandy. Oh, did you, Carol? What a beautiful idea. So on that first little um, strip, I put this one down, okay? And why am I stuck? Why am I stuck? See, I'm not used to using this for lives. I think I have to stick with my Tombow. I went over. I went over my line. And of course, this happens during the live, right? I think it's the rule. Oh, sweet as a peach. That would have been beautiful, Carol. 94. Wow, what a blessing to be 94. Okay, so we've got that first panel down. Let's open it up and let's move here. And now I'm going to use my Tombow. I'm just more used to Tombow than I am to the tear and tape or the, um, the whatever it's called. So I'm just putting adhesive in the center of it. Let's take our other down and we're going just close to the score line, not over, just close to the score line. Is everybody there? And yes, Lucy, thank you for saying that. That's so sweet. Happy birthday to your mom, Carol. We're gonna put a little bit on this one like so. This card's going to be done before you know it. 
Okay, and I'm just staying in the center of these panels. Just staying in the center. And again, I'm staying away from my score line. I'm just a smidge in. So probably about a 32nd of an inch in. And that one's down. Let's, uh, we don't need to, yeah, let's leave that open. We're going to put a little bit of glue or tape runner or whatever it is that you're using. Girls, please let me know when you are here to this point so that I don't move on way ahead of you. Okay, so let's get that down again with just a smidge of the score line showing. Okay, whoops. I didn't give that a chance to cure quite yet. I moved too quick. Okay, who is at this point? Who is at this point? Okay, let me know when you're ready. Now before we start adhering the rest of our pieces, if on the inside of your tower you have a directional piece of, of DSP showing, make sure that you are positioned the right way, okay? Sherry, you're good. So for an example, for this one here, this uh, piece of DSP inside my tower is directional, so I made sure that that was standing the right way and not upside down, okay? Follow? Everybody good to go? Everybody's good to go. Okay, I got a thumbs up from Lucy and Karen and, and uh, Sherry. Okay, so now what we're going to do, let's grab our, our neutral and our three pieces of DSP, right? As well as our four small pieces of DSP. Okay, and now what you're going to do is this is strictly whatever is pleasing to your eye. Okay, so obviously I want to make sure that first of all, if my if I'm directional inside my tower that I'm placing I, I'm placed the right way. This is going to be the top of my card. This is going to be the bottom of my card. And you know what? Let me show you something very interesting. You know how our tower is four and a quarter tall? So let me grab an envelope. So again, I'm four and a quarter inches tall on this. And across, I am five and a half inches. This card fits in a regular A2 envelope, okay? That's why I chose this size. <coughs> Pardon me, I need a little sip of water here. There we go. Now also, when I asked you to cut your DSP, I stayed with um, easier uh, cut measurements like two and a half by four, two and three quarters um, by, by four and a quarter and things like that so that there were no funky like eights or anything like that. <coughs> Pardon me, I've got a tickle. When you create another card using this, if you prefer a thinner border, oh, I think I cut that wrong. If you prefer a thinner border, um, you're, you're just going to add another eighth of an inch to all of your pieces. And I did. I cut these <coughs> incorrectly. Let me see if it was just one or if it was all of them. It was just one. Okay. So now what you're going to do is you're going to decide how you want your card laid out. No right or wrong. So see, this is what I meant. If you want a little smaller, like a thinner border, because I know um, I know many of you girls have been creating with me for quite a while and you do prefer a thinner border, but again, I wanted easier cut directions. All you would do is you would just make all of these pieces 
uh, with the cut directions just a smidge larger okay so now all you're gonna do oh I like the polka dots I think I think I like this so this is what I'm gonna do on these panels and this is all you're doing girls so you are just putting your adhesive down on the side that you want against your cardstock and again you want to make sure you're not going over let's put that down center that on our little panel I love these polka dots this paper is so gorgeous And ladies, I do want to see what you have created. So obviously, this piece here that I'm putting adhesive on is whoop, the back side. I think I'm getting low. I need to have that sitting upside down. Again, if you're using directional DSP, make sure you are going in the right direction. I've got glue all over my hands. Let's open this up and let's carry on to this side. And what do we have here? What do I want to do here? <laughs> Hello, I am back. Sorry about that. So sorry about that. So crazy. Is anybody coming back or are you just finished with me? Oh my goodness. That's brutal. That is brutal. Sorry about that. You know what? I've got my phone on silence and yeah, I'm back too. <laughs> That's crazy. Um, I've got my phone on silence and it started ringing and uh, I just ignored it. Stampin' Up! delivery at my door. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Sorry about that, ladies. It's just been bonkers lately. My, uh, I, I had card class yesterday and I bumbled through like it was just crazy. Um, I don't know what's going on. So am I still live? Okay, I think I am. Yes, I'm back. Sorry about that, ladies. My the first the first interruption was my doctor, and uh, I never did get to the call. And then the second interruption was. Um, was my front gate and I have to tell you I'm not a fan of living in a gated community okay now let's get back to our card what have I done thus far um, I think I want I think I am really I love these stripes I think I'm liking that what do you think of that I think I am liking that so am I really choppy, girls, or is, is everything okay? Hello again, yes. Tall but skinny. You know what? That's better than, than nothing. So let's do it that way. This is not my favorite way to do videos, that's for sure. But I have a feeling that, um, that I'm okay. So let's do that. Sorry about that. Wow. Wow, what is with this week? I, uh, I was telling a girlfriend that I was feeling a little bit flustered the other day and I was just like, you know what, I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. And now this, are you kidding me? Just when I thought I was starting to really get the hang of Facebook Lives, I don't know what that was all about, girls. Sorry about that. And I don't know how to stop my phone from ringing because it's not supposed to. I do have it on Do Not Disturb. And I don't know why 
it still rang. Okay, so now I've got a little piece of glue here. You want to make sure that's off. This is going to be for a sentiment or whatever. Okay, so that's going to go there and I'm going to cut another strip because I had cut that wrong. So let's see, I want four and a quarter. So that is correct. Four and a quarter by, um, what is that one? My four pieces by two and three quarters. Really, that looks big. Um, I don't think that's the one. Uh, where is it? Well, there's the mistake. Girls, I think by one and a half inches. You know what? I steered you all incorrectly. This was supposed to be four and a quarter as well because the depth of our card is four and a quarter. Wow, am I fired yet? Am I fired yet? This is wrong. It should have been one and a half by four and one quarter, okay? Four and one quarter. My apologies, I've messed you all up. And these is the same thing by four and one quarter, not four inches. Two and a half by four and, um, wait a minute. No, 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 no. What is this? No, it is, it is by four. Sorry, we're good, we're good. Ha, 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 ha. Oh my goodness, I'm having many, many issues. And now it looks like I'm frozen. Facebook and Shaw is very, very mad at me right now. Can you girls still hear me or am I frozen? Have I been bumped off? No, I think I'm good. I think I'm still here. Let's get that cord out of the way because that bothers me. You know what I did today? I phoned Bell, and on Monday, we are having Bell installed instead of Shaw. And my hope is that things will improve for me. I am still on. Oh my goodness. I think now I'm just a real basket case, and I meant to bring I meant to bring my um, stamp set forward, and I did not. So you know what? I'm going to decorate this panel later. I don't need to do it right now. But, but before you put down your neutral cardstock, you're going to want to decorate it, okay? So that's where you would decorate it. And with, with this card, this is what I did, okay? So I stamped the leaves from gorgeous leaves. I stamped these little leaves and I stamped one in Cajun Craze and one in um, I put my uh, pumpkin pie and then these leaves I cut out using the intricate leaves die. These are so beautiful and what I did for these leaves um, see the color in here? Uh, where's these? The big one and and all of these. That is just the back side of one of the DSPs, okay, that I used on the more intricate pieces. I still have to clean those out, but I was in a rush. So you're going to decorate this however you want and then you're gonna put that down on your card, okay? So I'm gonna do that later. But now, what you wanna do is what I did right here. This was a little extra thing that I didn't have, okay? So this uh, card stock measures um, two and three eighths inch by two inches, okay? So if you wanna take that down, if you wanna make a pocket, and you're just going to decide where you want your pocket. So again, it's two and three eighths 
by two inches, okay? I'm just trying to decide where I want my pocket. And I think I want it here because I don't want to interrupt my my little penguins and, and my snowmen. So that's going to go down there. And then the DSP that's going to go on top of that. Oh, that's too matchy-matchy for me. I can't handle that. Maybe I, yeah, maybe I will cover him anyway. So let's see that one or that one. I'm going to cover this one. Okay. So you're going to adhere your two and a quarter by one and seven eighths inch. You're going to put your adhesive behind that. Okay. Let's move up here. Wow. That is such a bad angle. Okay. Here we go. I think because my camera is, there we go. Oh, girls, I am so sorry. This is quite embarrassing for me. I'm afraid to bring the camera up. You don't want to see my face because I, I'm cross-eyed now. Let's bring this closer. Put that adhesive down like so. And then what you're going to do is, well, this is what I did anyway, to make your pocket, I'm going to use my tear and tape, and I'm just going really close to the edge, and then I'm just going to tear that with my, with my ruler. This is how I like to use my tear and tape with my, with my little ruler. I get it nice and close to the edge. And then I just hold my ruler down and pull that up. Okay? Kathy, I love you too. You have such an encouraging heart. Thank you. I needed that. Feeling a little... It's pretty choppy, isn't it? I think my, I think my feed is pretty choppy. And now after all of that, I was going to say I can't find my take your pick tool. It was right in front of me. Hokey Dinah. Here's my little pocket. I avoided anything on this side. And let's put that back down on here. With the dimensions that I gave you, I on purpose left a little bit of a border. Okay? Now you don't have to. You can cut that a different size if you would rather. But that's what I did. <clears throat> Then I took basic white, and I'm going to decorate this as well. <clears throat> Pardon me. I still haven't decorated this one. And I got this from the tailor-made tags dies. These would make fantastic tags for your Christmas gifts, and you could just knock them off real quick. You would use... The, uh, you would use your, your neutral on the front, let's say. I used this size here for this one, but if I had DSP, I could put DSP in front of that, and then I would have the DSP on the back, but I, I just left it this way for this, okay? Am I making any sense? I think I'm so frazzled now that I'm not making sense. I took about a six inch piece of ribbon and I fold it in half and then I'm going to fold it in half again and I'm going to feed it through the hole. I'm going to make my little, um, my little hole and pass these ribbons or the open ends through and I'm just going to give that a gentle little tug. And I've got my ribbon cut at an angle so it doesn't continue to fray, okay? If you don't cut your ribbon at an angle, it will continue to fray on you, okay? Sorry about that noise. That's my, my exercise ball, and I just stood up to make sure I was okay because I think I keep freezing here. So there is your tower card. What a blooper of a day this was. My goodness, I am going to sign off.
because I'm so frustrated. <laughs> My goodness. But let's pick our names, okay? So Darlene submitted a card from last week. And if anybody else has, please let me know if, if I'm missing anyone, okay? So thanks, Dar, for that. I know it's not my fault. It's just really frustrating. So Darlene, she shared a card. Thank you for that. Jean shared last week. Susan shared last week. If anybody else did submit a card and I, I have not uh, seen it, please let me know. Carol shared last week. Barb did. Sherry shared last week. Gail did as well. Tracy did. Jenny B did. That um, Jenny is a new name, so that was nice to have her. And Kathy shared and Lucy shared. I am going to bring the camera up. I'm a little nervous. I'm not sure what's going to happen. Maybe I've got a funky hat on. Here we go. Camera's coming up. Okay. Okay. This is what frustrated looks like. Okay. And now I think I'm sideways. Hang on. Here we go. Now I'm probably long and narrow. So crazy. What a crazy day. Not fun for me. Not fun for me because I, I hope I haven't lost you all. Did everybody get a chance to make their card? Is everybody okay? Is everybody okay? You cre uh, It's such a fun card. You submitted one. Yay, that's great, Sherry. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. What a bumble of a day. What a bumble of a day. I don't know if it's 3 o'clock is not a good time or what okay I've got one name let's see who has won Sherry you have won so do you want the autumn card or do you want the playful penguins let me know and uh, Lucy it's such a fun card to make it it seriously is and it's so easy um, the dimensions are on my Facebook page uh, the dimensions will also be on my YouTube channel, and um, it, it'll just be under the uh, under all of the info. I think you just hit more, and it shows you more. If you have not subscribed to uh, my YouTube channel, I would love it if you did. And uh, Cherie, I think you're, or Sherry, sorry, I think you're still here. Just let me know which card you want, okay? You can either have the playful penguins, look how sweet that is, or the autumn card, okay? So uh, Sherry, let me know which one you want and I will get that sent off to you. With that, I am going to say so long, have a lovely weekend. Oh, and before I go, I need to let you know something very important. Um, I'm not sure if I shared this uh, last week. Oh, Sandy, you're welcome. Oh, I hope you're able to create a card after all these bumbles through this live for sure. And I know I keep uh, I keep freezing out. It's because today is nine nine and the oh, okay. I'll have to reread that. Your uh, Sherry, your comment went up um, real quick here. Um, Dean is retiring, okay? I don't know if I shared this with you, but on on Wednesday, um, so uh, in like in a little bit less than a week, Wednesday is Dean's last day at work, okay? So they're doing um, they're doing a nice big uh, luncheon for him um, about 11 o'clock in the morning. And so I'm going to be going as well. Um, and we're going to be packed and ready to go because right after that we are hitting the road and we are on vacation. So you know what? I feel really bad. I haven't done this since I started doing my lives. I am taking two weeks off, okay? So there will be no Facebook Live demos for two weeks. But there's a good chance that I'm still going to pop on just to say hi and let you girls know where we're at. Um, so be watching for that. Um, I'm assuming next week, Thursday, 
uh, we will be in Vancouver so I can show off my grandkids but I will not be showing off a card so please do still come it won't be anything creative though um, and then the following Thursday we will likely I'm thinking we will likely be slowly on route home I'm not sure where we will be but stay posted for that and uh, I will say hi from wherever we are so maybe we'll be in the mountains or maybe we'll be in the prairies who knows I don't know where we're going to be so thank you for safe travels and um, have a wonderful two weeks uh, I am ready for my next live when I do get home, and so I will see you then. With that, I'm going to say adieu. Have a lovely week. Be blessed. Be encouraged. Um, be strong and be safe. We will talk to you all later. Bye now.